So guys, today's Ghana's independence, set mark 1957 to 66 years, I think, yeah. And of course, the diaspora people didn't disappoint. 12 midnight, pepe, pepe. People were changing their DPs and their, their chaleo, dropping the Ghana flags everywhere. But anyways, it's happening at the voter region and Showboy is there, you know, representing life. But unfortunately, Mahama didn't show up. And here's his reason why he didn't show up. Because it's become a party jamboree. I went to Tamale. They told GBC to take the camera off me. They bust their supporters in and filled the whole stadium. When I got into the stadium, the place was quiet. I went and sat. And any of them who came in, hey, hey. And I said, I don't want to be part of this party jamboree. Independence is a solemn national celebration. We should celebrate it at the Independence Square. And everybody wanted to come, could come. So as you can see, uh, I mean, I leave it to you. Tell me, tell me what you think. Is there a good reason for him not to show up? Because Charlie, hmm. Charlie, you tell me what you think. Basically, tell me what you think. Yo. The former first lady and the president of the Lordina Foundation, Mrs. Lordina Dramani Mahama, has presented her paternal and maternal hometowns, that's Ampoma and Bodum, with water supplying systems to celebrate her seated birthday, which is also the same day as Ghana's independence. Happy birthday, Mrs. Lordina Mahama. And through your efforts and your philanthropical works, we hope that more people will be blessed. Thank you very much. The President's Cup, which was between Kotoko and Haas over the weekend, saw Haas of Hook snatch the title from Kotoko and Haas with the help of Kunedu Yadom's header, a spectacular goal. And that was the only goal of the match. So Haas won the President's Cup and our own showboy was there. Uh, apparently, I heard that the, the stadium was not full enough, so he had to make people you know, come in. He opened the gates for to come in, which was a good gesture. And we thank the President for that. Now moving on to Nigeria, Gola Tinubu has been uh, announced the president-elect of the just-ended general elections in Nigeria by Electoral Commission. Uh, as he addressed the nation, he said um, he's hoping to, to not disappoint the people. But with regards to the election, election results, um, Uncle Greg, that's Peter Obi, and uh, Atiku Abuaka, uh, <laughs> they said they won't agree with the results, so they are taking the issue to court. So I asked myself, uh, has anyone won, you know, this kind of issue concerning the results in, in court? And apparently no. So why don't you just share the presidency and all rule the country? You know, that, that will make it more, you know, easy, but you know, that's not possible. Democracy is not possible. So I think uh, they have to find a more amicable way to solve this issue. We don't want any form of war or tally. Just, you guys should find a way to sort the issue out. And, you know, whoever, I mean, is, is the winner, the true winner should just, you know, be announced as the as the winner. Enough of this whole presidency. Let's come to you know other other topics. Um, Haja Foro, you guys heard about the rumors that uh, she has been convicted and to be sentenced ten years in prison. Her management has come out with a statement that it's not true. Number one, she hasn't been convicted. She has not been convicted, convicted before, whether U.S. or U.K. Number two, she's currently in the U.K. Number three, her child has not been taken away from her. So I beg you guys, well, if you hear some information. Do research. Make sure that your source is solid, because these things can 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 go a long way to help people. So I beg you guys, wah, please and please make sure you do your research very well before you come out with any form of information. So Bingo Pharmaceuticals has donated an ultrasound uh, machine to the Tema Polyclinic. Uh, this machine is supposed to be used as the um, maternity ward to help you know the doctors and the health you know uh, workers. Scan and know the babies whether they are twins, triplets, quadruplets, whatever you know. It's going to help them. It's a very good gesture, and we are very grateful for that. Charlie, see, if you go to some hospitals and you see, hey Charlie, it will be terrible. It will be terrible. But I mean, yeah, this is a good gesture, and I hope other companies or individuals will also look at what they are doing and even do more. So, Tomiko Pharmaceuticals, thank you very much. God bless you. All right. So, the Jameson Connect event. <music> was lit, 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 Charlie. Hey! I've, I've never seen an event where it has so many activities going on and it was so well, like, it was just nice. It was just lit. See, Joey B can perform. r 2 bs Black Hole. Yo, Charlie was nice. Aside that, people were, were cutting their hair. Charlie, like there were different activities going on and it was nice it was fun and if you're in the chalet 
don't miss the next one. JMC Connects, their, their programs or their events are always lit. So Charlie, force them be there. And finally, enough, it was free. It was free, Ibab. So Charlie, next time, make it a point to be at the JMC Connect event. Our very own Abang, the Ghana Police Service, has come up with a program called the Police Action Against Radar Indiscipline. Now, this program is here to catch all those Okada people, all those people who have been riding motorbikes and be crossing red lights. <laughs> This program started somewhere last week, so I beg you, the rules are the rules, okay? Let's follow them. Red means stop, yellow means get ready or slow down, green means go. You know, see green, I make you know go. And they beg you people. See, if they catch you, out, Charlie, then they take you go. That's when they go find you or they go arrange you before court. So I beg you, Charlie, I beg, I beg, I beg. Because Charlie, <laughs> if you see some of the accidents these guys get into, uh, Charlie, it's, 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 it's sad. So I beg you guys, uh, be safe out there, okay? Follow the regulations, follow the rules. And you'll be fine, you'll be safe. The police is your friend. Do you understand? Abang is your friend. So let's follow the rules and regulations and let's be safe. All right? The Electoral Commission of Ghana, who uh, is headed by the by Jim Mensah, sorry, has come out with a statement that the Ghana card will not be used to vote in the upcoming elections in 2024. She said that the Ghana card will not be used to vote in the 2024 elections. Only the voters' ID card. So I beg you people, get your voter's ID card. You can go to the EC website, the steps are there, follow it to get your voter's ID card. You cannot use your Ghana card to vote. No. It will shock you that you go there, yeah, there to the police station with your Ghana card and they will sack you. Black Volta and B for BGH is organizing a three-day party at the Totulum stage of Asabako at the Buzia Beach. And Charlie, this three-day party, <laughs> it be late. Hey, it is Joe Mancasa. And today being the last day, see, don't, don't be surprised when, when it becomes too late. Trust me, this party is, is just... Then I wish I did there. <laughs> I wish I did there. But it is Joe Mancasa, it is Joe Mancasa, yeah. All right, in other news, Betway Ghana has landed a new office at Osu near the Kuala shopping mall. And um, Kenata was there to, you know, perform at the, the, the main events, I mean, the opening. But what I want to tell you guys is, in case you're there on Osu, where they have the food or the size of the food, where you won't cut your slip, Charlie, just walk in there, cut them sharp, do one fine, you know, a ring jam, don't be too greedy, because bet you have to bet responsibly. Of course, for the love of the game, but bet responsibly. And if you want bet, you want do one proper, I'm not sure, give me a call. Put my number down in the, in the, in the description. Give me a call. If you want to do one over, sir, unless maybe Liverpool versus United, you go do one over 6.5. You bad. Yeah, so best way has opened a new office at Osu. And Charlie, walk in, cut your slave, Charlie, feel free, you understand? Feel free. Charlie, bet with big ups for the love of the game. And I beg you guys, bet responsibly. Thanks for watching. Don't forget to comment, like, subscribe, you know, and if you feel like there's something you want to, you know, communicate to me or to the team, Charlie, send us an email. Do you get me? Yeah. Thanks for watching. Catch you next time.